Hey everybody, welcome back. We got the horses up to the weavers and dropped them off. It was horrible, poured down rain the whole way up here. Got in after dark and when we got in, the horses didn't know where they were going and didn't the smells and the sounds and all that, but we got them into their stalls and got them settled down for the night and um, they're doing real well. So they're gonna start training on Monday. So that'll be real good. But right now we're at the Mid-Ohio Draft Horse Sale and I'm gonna take you around and show you the sights and sounds of what's going on here. We got farm equipment, we got carts and wagons and carriages, and then we've got the draft horses. I'm not gonna show you the ponies and the buggy horses and the, um, the saddle horses, but I'm gonna focus on the draft horses, the Belgians and the Percherons. I'm just gonna take you around and give you a sample of a little bit of everything that's going on.
goat wagon here.
They never mentioned it out here. He hitched here. He hitched okay. They're three and four years old. They're four brothers. Buy the piece and two times the money. And when they come from David, they'll be broke. Yes, sir, gentlemen. How many of them want to get a baby? How many of them want to get a baby? Five hundred. I get five thousand here. Five thousand dollars here. Five. You got three. I get three thousand. Five thousand dollars here. Five thousand dollars here. Five grand. I get five thousand. So that was just a quick sampling. This auction runs Monday through Friday. We're only here Wednesday through Friday. Um, all of the cataloged horses in here are Monday through Friday's horses, and there was 2,276 cataloged horses. They'll run the uncataloged horses through this evening. There'll be another 125 to 150 uncataloged, and you never know what's coming through. So it's a good time to come up and, and watch that. But this starts at 9 in the morning and runs all afternoon, and you're just seeing less than an hour. So as you can see, there is a whole lot of stuff going on. I didn't even show you the vendors, the antiques, the um, the tack. Um, inside they have collars and they've got a bunch of stall equipment, um, buckets and lead ropes and all that type. So I didn't even show you any of that. That went on all afternoon, all day Wednesday. So there's a lot of stuff. This is free to the public. It's Monday through Friday. The next time they have it every March and every October, it's it's October 7 through 11. Um, it's just it's a really neat deal. Again, it's free to the public, and the Amish are just super accommodating. So I will keep you posted on Gene and Grace as their progress continues. As long as I get updates from them, one interesting note: I dropped the girls off with the Weavers, as I told you, in the pouring down rain. That team, that, that black team that went for $20,000 times two was the Weavers team that they bought two years ago as a three and, as a two and three year old. Hey, knock it off. As a two and three year old, and he brought them back two years later as a four and five year old and sold them for $20,000 times two. But that farm is where my girls are. So they're in good hands. So looking forward to giving you guys updates on that. And I appreciate you guys coming along. As always, remember who you are. Be kind to those around you. Stand up for what you believe in.